Hi there and welcome to my first drum tutorial. Today we're going to look at Bernard Purdy's halftime shuffle groove, sometimes known as the Rosanna beat that Jeff Porcaro played on the Toto record, or the groove that John Bonham played on Led Zeppelin's Fool in the Rain. And I'm going to try to show you how about how Bernard Purdy played it on a couple of Steely Dan songs, Home at Last and Babylon Sisters. It was something approximately, approximately like this. And a lot of people have trouble playing that groove because the left hand, which plays a lot of little ghost notes on the snare, if I play it without the ghost notes, it sounds something like this. counterintuitive. So, I want to try and make it intuitive by breaking it down and using a mnemonic aid, a song lyric that's fairly well known, to simplify the sticking or make the sticking more understandable. And the song I've chosen for this is a little crazy. It was a novelty record back in the 60s called They're Coming to Take Me Away. It went, they're coming to take me away. And, uh, yeah, a lot of people found it pretty annoying, but in this case, I find it useful in terms of how to break down the P Bernard Purdy halftime shuffle into a sticking pattern that can be understood. Some people have actually used this method that I'm about to teach you to learn the groove with, which had previously eluded them. I'm going to take the words, they're coming to take me away, ha ha, and I'm going to add the word and at the end. The first word, there, is actually the pickup note from the previous measure. But it's going to go, they're coming to take me away, ha ha, and they're coming to take me away, ha ha, and. So what we've got happening is the left hand playing the ghost notes on the syllables ming, me, and then there's an accent on a So, ming, me, way, and they're coming to take me away, ha ha, and they're coming to take me away, ha ha, and they're coming to take me away, ha ha. So, they're coming to take me away, ha ha, and they're coming to take me away, ha ha, and they're coming to take me away. to add a little bit on the kick drum, that first pickup note there would be a good place for it, because it's actually the last sixteenth note triplet of the previous measure. So, I hope that helps, and if it happens to help anybody or mess anybody up, either way, you can uh, drop me a message and let me know how it turned out for you. Thanks a lot. See you the next time.